Hello, my name is Frank Huang, and in this video, I want to show you how to quickly toggle back and forth between part and full score on the Henley app. As a chamber musician, this is a big game changer. Let's say you are a violinist in a piano trio, for example, and you want to see what the other musicians are playing. No longer do you need to manually switch back and forth between part and full score. From my experiences watching my colleagues doing this, this was a bit tiring and cumbersome. Now, thanks to the Henley app, the study of chamber music has become a lot more convenient. Let me quickly show you how this works. Before continuing on, I want to stress an important thing in order for this to work. You must purchase the same title of both, the instrumental part and the full score from the Henley library. As you can see here, I opened up the violin part of a Brahms piano trio. I also have the full score purchased as well. Now look at what happens when I touch with one finger on this staff. Here at the bottom, you will now see an option for you to jump to the full score of the corresponding measures. And you can easily navigate back to the violin part by tapping here again and tapping down here. It's really that quick and easy. This also works for concertos too. In the case of the Beethoven Emperor Concerto, here's the solo piano part without the orchestra. Now, when I tap here, as I previously showed you, it will take me to the orchestra score. I would also like to mention that Henley has it currently set that the default jump will always be to the full score. If only the piano reduction is available, then the switch will occur there. Again, I love how seamless and easy it is to navigate between the various scores. When I coach chamber music groups, I tell my students to always know each other's parts. Now, with the Henley app, there's really no excuse. I hope you enjoyed this video and will consider using this wonderful app. To read my review and overview, please see the link below. Thanks for watching.